Hey everybody, Adam and Mike K. Welcome to a mystery costume unboxing. Uh, it's not as exciting as you think. It's not like someone sent me a costume and I don't know what it is. I actually bought this costume. Uh, I'm pretty sure it is some kind of armor, soldier armor, from some past, like medieval or Egyptian or something. I don't know. There'll be a certificate of authenticity in there and then we'll know the movie. But I bought this on Prop Store's website of literally probably eight, 10 months ago because it was a good deal. Uh, and I like to collect full suits of armor type stuff. I've covered, you know, uh, armor suits I have from Immortals, from uh, the, the Chronicles of Narnia films, etc. And this is another in that line. I just can't remember what it is. So uh, it's, I mean, it's been a hectic few months. So we're gonna crack this open and we're gonna spill some peanuts all over the place and we're gonna unpack this costume and try it on. Yeah, this is gonna be... All right. There we go. All right. Helmet. Sandals, helmet crest. This is, I have never received a package from them so well labeled. Tunic. Well, that's gonna be an early thing. Let's see here. Oh, 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 there's lots going on here. This is really exciting. What else we got? No, nothing, 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 that's it. All right. What, as to why I went and made so much extra work for myself, I, I don't know. Oh, 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 here we go. This is the COA. We find out what movie this is from. Ah, uh, this is complete hoplite soldier costume and helmet from Immortals. That's what it was. I've covered, you know, uh, armor suits I have from Immortals. Uh, yeah, it was too good a deal to pass up. So there's a fully muscular breastplate. There's a helmet with a crest. It's gonna be awesome. Uh, tunic. That's definitely gonna be the first thing. Cape? Cape? <laughs> I'm just so happy to have something labeled cape. Edna Mood would disagree, I know, I know but. Okay, that is the tunic and that is the cape. This is the sandals and helmet crest. Helmet. So uh, one of the reasons if you purchase stuff from Prop Store that so much of it is wrapped in linen is because this is a wonderful archival uh, fabric for keeping things from sticking to each other. Ah, I see, okay. I have here a helmet. This is uh, Patrick Levine's helmet, L-A-V-I-G-N-E. Patrick, I've got your helmet. Uh, and then I guess this comes up here. Uh, let's see, which, which way does it go? That or, I think it's that. I wonder as I always do if we actually know the people that made this armor. Okay, so there, yeah, 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 they've got the wrong screw in here. Okay, hold on, I need a longer one of those. And that is metric. And for, is that longer? It's a little bit longer, should be enough. Boy, finally, 
I was literally just too short by like an eighth of an inch. There we go. Now that's not going anywhere. Excellent. Cool. Yes. Okay. Good. Now we pull out the sandals and this is the exciting part. Look at this, this is actually real leather. This is genuine leather armor. Holy cow. Uh, hold on. Yeah, there's that. Okay. Oh, oh, legs. Forgot about legs. Oh, this is great. Prop store guys, I, I'm pretty sure you didn't even realize you were sending this to me. I just so appreciate your packing. Well done, everybody. I think I'm, I'm going to have to clean up all this before I put this on. Oh, look at that. And this seems to me like it is, uh, yeah, this seems to me like your standard polyurea with uh, some leather strapping. This will be a little laborious to put on. And there is the other one. Leg armor looks terrific. This one says Lois, and this one says LP. I always like the labels inside these things. Um, okay, so I made a mess. I'm gonna clean it up. Give me just a minute. Yeah. This is legitimate leather armor. Um, that I did not expect that. Gilbert LaRose stunt. Size 42. Yeah, this is fantastic. Okay. Um, I don't feel like putting on the sandals. Is that okay? Can we just elide the sandals for this costume up? I think I'm gonna elide the sandals. Okay. So this is the tunic and this is probably gonna be, yeah, this is, oh, there we go. Yeah, this is. Yeah, I'm wearing blue jeans. I'm wearing blue jeans. If there were blue jeans back then, they would have worn blue jeans. Okay, uh, remember, always do, oh, right, XR, PL. Okay, this is a right leg. Ooh, ooh, ow. Oh, ow. Hmm. Well, that's something. So, yeah, they strap up the back, but again, I don't, I don't really need to do that for this suit up. Um, that is a terrific bit of leg armor. Super lightweight, stays right on. Um, we've got the leather strapping for it, but I think that it's unnecessary. Yeah. Oh yeah, we'll get it on this one because it's just a little bit looser. Uh, let's see here. That's great. Those are wonderful. Fabulous. Okay, now we've got this business, which is, uh, yeah, they usually leave it so it can be tightened up on one side. Mm. I shouldn't be wearing my watch? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> yeah. I don't have a weapon. I'm gonna need a weapon. Oh, I got one here. So then there is a cape. Fabulous. Oh, look at that. All right, put it in the outside. Yeah. That was it. Cool. Yeah. 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 All right. 
And then, wait, yeah, different franchise. This is, what is this, Scorpion King, I think? Could be. All right. Oh, look at that, it's got these little sideburns. Oh, this is fabulous. There we go, ladies and germs. Yeah, I know, I think this is Scorpion King or some other franchise, Hercules, could be, yeah. Hey, it's good enough. Dude, this was a deal. That's why I bought it, and I'm really glad that I have it. I have not seen Immortals. I cannot speak to its quality, but I can speak to the quality of its costumes, because this one feels fantastic, and it's real leather armor! <sighs> I need a different one, and this one isn't the right one. Hold on. I'm like a kind of a foot soldier. Hold on. All right. Yeah. That's much more like it, right? Spear. I'm a spear carrier. <laughs> yeah, that is that is that is definitely my role as an extra. Uh, this is a bronze Hellboy spear tip that I made with Grim Tim, Tim Arp, 15 years ago. There are five of these in the world. Uh, this is one of the two I own, and uh, it seems pretty appropriate. It feels like exactly the right thing here. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. Let's go out. Let's go clash with some titans. Hey guys, Adam Savage from Tested here. If you've ever seen the six inch ruler in inches and centimeters on my forearm and wanted one of your own, but you didn't want it to be permanent, well, today's your lucky day. You can now buy temporary tattoos of my measuring stick my measuring forearm uh, at tested-store.com. Comes like this, goes on in about 30 seconds with a little water. The instructions are on the back. It comes off with rubbing alcohol and hopefully it warms you up to the idea of permanently attaching a measuring device to your body because I use mine every single day.